Christmas Day 1989, I received two games for Christmas. Bugs Bunny Crazy Castle and DuckTales. Needless to say, I played one a lot more than the other. Andre and I'm a black nerd. So DuckTales the video game is getting a remastered version for the PlayStation Network, Xbox Live, and the Wii U. And an explosion of nerdgasm happened all across the world, all the way from PAX East to Boston to all points in between. Everyone just going, woo, in unison. But if you're under the age of me, you're probably wondering, why is everyone getting so excited about an HD remake to a 1989 Nintendo 8-bit video game based on an old cartoon series? Shut up, you whippersnappers. I'm about to teach you something. I'm going to tell you why DuckTales on the NES is the best. Nostalgia ever! DuckTales on the NES is loved because it's one of the very few video games based on a TV or movie property that's good. Usually when people make video games based on TV shows, movies, or cartoons, they're usually really bad. They just throw them out there right away just to make a quick buck. But check this. DuckTales the cartoon came out in 1987. Not to mention all the Uncle Scrooge comic books that date as far back as the 50s. But DuckTales the video game came out in 1989, not long before the end of the entire series of the cartoon. That means this game was given some love. And you could tell the people that made this game knew a lot about the cartoon series just from all the appearances and references it has in the game. Not only do you get Scrooge McDuck, you get Huey, Dewey, Louie, Webby, Launchpad, McQuack, Mrs. Beakley, the Beagle Boys, Glomgold, Magic of the Spell, Gizmo Duck, even Bubba Duck. More like Bubba Suck. And are we all that surprised that DuckTales is a good video game? After all, it was made by the same creators and used the same game engine as another Capcom game. One you probably heard of, Little Blue Bomber by the name of Mega Man. Actually, we all remember Mega Man, but sometimes I wonder if Capcom does. Personally, I think more cartoon video games should be based on popular video game engines. Imagine a Roadrunner game using the same game engine as Sonic the Hedgehog. Or a Smurfs video game using the same engine as Pikmin. Or an Earthworm Jim cartoon video game that's based on the same engine as the Earthworm Jim video game. Okay, wait, that's already was a game first and then became a cartoon. Now let's talk about that cane, pimp. Most characters in 8-bit Nintendo video games had two functions. They could jump and they could attack. A button jump. B button attack. Not DuckTales! Scrooge didn't just walk around on that cane. He could bounce with that cane. He could use that cane as a golf club. He could open up treasure chests with it. He could grab launch pads plane with it. That cane could do anything. And not only did DuckTales have multiple cane possibilities, it also had multiple levels of difficulty. You could choose to play it as easy, medium, or hard. And it also wasn't linear. You could choose any of the five stages to go to at any time. And once you beat all five, then you got to the final stage, just like Mega Man. It even had multiple endings depending on how much money you collected and how much treasure you found along the way. Did you know there's even a secret ending that you can see if you beat the game with no money? That is detail. You don't get that kind of detail in games based on TV shows or movies back in the day like that. They just like, Psh, here's a game. DuckTales was smart. It was a cartoon that everyone loved that had a good video game. It didn't stray that far from the series. It gave us the characters we loved. Everything we liked about the cartoon was right there in the video game. It's the perfect combination for the best nostalgia ever. Oh yeah, and there's one more thing. That mother moon theme. glad that DuckTales is getting an HD remake. Now that Disney has its own gaming company, I never thought something like this would happen. So it's really cool to see Disney and Capcom working together to bring this classic game back to the forefront. Now all I'm asking is that the next time you make a Marvel vs. Capcom video game, why don't you slide Scrooge McDuck in there as a playable character? I'm just saying. Scrooge vs. Deadpool. Let's make that happen. Now I want to hear from you. What is your favorite video game that's based on a cartoon? Leave a comment or a video response. Be sure to like and favorite this video, tickle that subscribe button, and check out my gaming channel, Story and Shell where me and Katie play different video games. There may be some ducks that might show up on that channel. I'm just saying. I love you like a play cousin. I'm out of 5,000. Chain chomp. Yeah. Did you know that there was a second verse to the DuckTales theme song? When it seems they're heading for the final curtain, gold deduction never fails, that's for certain. The worst of messes become successes. DuckTales. Woo. I really need to get out more.